Michigan had a rough time. Yeah. That's okay. Let That's me just, this is the only thing I'll say, and this is, is just over the last four years. I had Scott Randall look some numbers up. Our last four champions that we've seen, Alabama, Florida, LSU, and Florida. And it's interesting if you look back and, and maybe just consider, take out the freshman class, but consider the other three classes. They all had two top 10 recruiting classes in there, and then one that was anywhere between 15th and 22nd. So, I don't, I don't know if that makes the case for it or not, but obviously if you've got two top ten recruiting classes and then within three years you're winning they're getting, a title. They're getting good talent. I don't, I, don't, I don't doubt that. I'm just saying as far as you have so many players, I have, I have so many um, people that went to school with me that weren't even on scholarship when they, when they went to college. Okay, uh, but they earned their scholarship and their That's still exactly out. right, but in the end, I can bet you that Florida and Texas, unfortunately, are going to be real good for the next four or five years. Yeah, the, the exception to the rule would be look at Alabama this year. They had the second rank recruiting class in 2009. This past yeah. one, throw that out. It was third, 17th, and 18th. So an interesting one there. That's going to do it for this topic. Coming up in fourth down, the folks at EA Sports putting a little twist on the cover of Madden 2010, trying to possibly combat the curse. We'll hear from about what these guys think about their idea and who they would vote for for the cover. Also coming up here on ESPN First Take, no one believed in the Jets more than head coach Rex Ryan this season. Now it's fourth downtime, one topic for you guys, a change in the Madden game, at least in the cover. For the first time in franchise history, fans get to vote on who's going to be on the cover. And you know we've always talked about whether or not there's this Madden curse. Starting Thursday, you can vote for Drew Brees, Reggie Wayne, or Jared Allen to be to appear on the next cover. Who are you voting? And, for? and let us point and, out. Yeah, you you play all three. Play all three. <laughs> well, if we could do a, like a, a, a trio. Oh, all of them. All three yeah, of them. Yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah, I don't want them to get hurt. Uh, maybe they get stuck in traffic or something. Yeah, right. <laughs> yeah, I like that. Yeah, all three of them. We could put all three of them on there. That would be great. Yeah, I, I, I'm buying that. Oh, they're. Yeah. There, there's that's we're pointing out again that they you will face all okay but if you had to pick one who do you if I had to pick most? one it had to be Reggie Wayne I mean, because that's okay because yeah, that's had your to guy okay, that's or whatever a little bit more yeah. so yeah okay. I, I'm gonna vote for uh, Terrell Owens but I'm just <laughs> he, he's, he's his friend I, I gotta you know this is unusual because it, it's a it's a little it's almost cowardly on the part of the company because the company's basically backing off saying we're, we're tired of taking the blame after, for this. After like, saying we're, taking we're the not fall. cursed, we're not like, cursed, we're not you cursed. You choose yeah. who's going to yeah. go down, right? That's so, bad. right. So, you know, I, I guess if you force me, I'm not the biggest Jared Allen fan, but then it's like I, I'm, like, you're like I want him to go right. down, and I, I don't want him exactly. to get hurt. That's, that's you know, the whole thing. Just, just stuck in traffic would be cool. I got to yeah. tell you, every time we've asked a player about it, they're like, I don't believe in a curse. I don't believe in it. So it's not like you're really cursing him because I think you have to believe in a curse you have for to believe a curse in it. to work. Yeah, it just, it's just putting him on the cover. This is an accolade. This is actually an a achievement. It's an honor. Yeah. Yeah, it's an honor to be on yeah, the cover. That's what so Troy Paul would you honor? Yeah. Would you and, <laughs> and keep going back. Yeah, I know. Exactly. And I don't believe in curses, and then I believe in what happens to the people on Madden. I don't know. The SI cover jinx went away. That's going to do it for our topics here. We still have a little more ESPN first take for you. A lot of talent on the field on Sunday. We put the quarterbacks aside. Who do you think is going to be the X factor in the game? 